The Universe 6 versus Universe 7 tournament. Team Shampa versus Team Beerus with the winners getting Universe 7's version of Earth is impending. And a lot of people have been asking lately about what the rules are of this tournament and there's been some confusion. So on this video I will tell you the rules of this tournament and how it's going to play out. Be sure to check out our friends over at Dragon Ball Z exclusives on Facebook. I will put the link down below. So here's how it's going to play out. Team Captains Beerus and Shampa, the gods of destruction from Universe 6 and Universe 7 respectively, are going to choose five members from each universe to compete in a Tenkaichi Budokai, also known as a Greatest Under the Heavens Martial Arts Tournament. But it's not going to be Under the Heavens, it's going to be fought on a planet that's called the Nameless Planet, named by Shampa, which is a neutral planet where both sides will come together and compete. Now, unlike the tournaments that we saw in Dragon Ball, this tournament will be fought a lot closer to the rules of the Uranai Baba tournament, featuring five members on each team. Team Beerus is set to be Goku, Piccolo, Vegeta, Majin Buu, and Beerus's fifth chosen mystery partner, whom he claims is the strongest fighter he's ever faced, which is the mysterious Monaka. However, Dragon Ball Super Chapter 8's manga reveals that Majin Buu was unable to pass the test, the written test that Vegeta had suggested them to have, and thus, as of right now, Team Beerus only has four members, Goku, Vegeta, Piccolo, and Monaka, and they will be fighting in that order according to Beerus, so Goku will go first. Over on Champa's team, we have five fighters from Universe 6. We have the mysterious Hito, or Hit, who is very mysterious. We don't know much about him. He is possibly the team captain. We know that Monaka is Beerus' team captain, but we don't know if Hito's going to be Champa's team captain, but it is possible based on the fact that the material is promoting him as such. He's going to be in there, as well as Frost, the Universe 6 Emperor and the Universe 6 version of Frieza, except he's not a villain. Kaba, or Kabe, who is the Saiyan, or Saiyan, from Universe 6. Majeta, which is the giant robot-looking guy who's actually not a robot. He's actually a part of a metallic species. He will be on that team. And, of course, the yellow Winnie the Pooh-looking guy, I guess you can call him, which is Botamo, who's actually going to be fighting first against Goku. The way it's going to work is, much like the World Martial Arts Tournament, you are not allowed to kill your opponent. Uh, the way you win a match is either by ring out or by defeating them via knockout. And Goku Botama will open the tournament, and the winner of the tournament will go on to face the next person in line. So if Botama wins, he faces Piccolo next. And then if he wins that one, he faces Vegeta. And then if he can beat Monaka, then Team Shampa wins. Not very likely it's going to happen. If Goku beats Botamo, he will then go on to face whomever the next member of Universe 6 is. As of right now, there's been tons of fan speculation about Team Beerus getting a fifth member, whether it be Gohan or Gotenks or even Vegito. I've heard all kinds of crazy rumors, but as of right now, as of this video, it's still set to be five versus four. That's pretty much what Beerus said. So Team Beerus is already at a disadvantage, but we'll see what happens. The winning team is the first to eliminate all members on the other team. As far as we know, unlike Pokemon and the Survivor Series, there's no tag teaming and no substitutions. You fight and continue fighting until you lose and are eliminated and the next person on your team takes over for you. Thanks a lot for watching the video and I hope I was able to clear up any misconceptions about what the rules are going to be for this tournament. I'm sure that we're all waiting with bated breath to see what happens. I know I'm excited and I know you are too. Let's all hope it's a good one. Don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. Share this video out to the world and I thank you very much for your support.